With a mandate of connecting people who care with causes that matter, the Victoria Foundation receives a huge variety of grant requests from all kinds of organizations. And this next story certainly illustrates that. Thanks to a grant from the Foundation, four support groups are able to fund a very unique and important program. Oh, look at, we have a beautiful girl here. Beautiful indeed. Four puppets, special delivery from Toronto, arrive at Headway, Victoria Epilepsy and Parkinson's Centre. Modeled uh, after myself. Yes. <laughs> a fun, uh, colourful, unique learning center. tool. There you go. Thank Welcome, you. Aisha. <laughs> we want to let all of the children know what seizures are really like and what it's like to have epilepsy. Mike! <laughs> and what it's like to be a new immigrant to Canada, to struggle with fetal alcohol syndrome. There is your new puppet. And to be diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder, or ASD. We got Steve here. Steve. Kids with ASD, they, you know, are dealing with so much isolation because they have those communication issues and they display, you know, stereotypy, so they might be walking down the hallway doing something that looks really bizarre. When most children come to Canada, they don't speak very good English, maybe bullied because they don't dress the same way or speak the same way, and hopefully this will just help break down some barriers. We just met, traveled in a box to get here. <laughs> Once up and running, the awareness program will be available to Greater Victoria Elementary and Middle Schools. And finally, that's Mike. Carolyn hopes her puppet, Mike, will help kids understand the huge challenges facing children with fetal alcohol spectrum disorder. There's not a lot of knowledge out there for people on FASD, and I find it very hard for them to cope with other children, and some children can be mean. I'm going to tell all the kids about my seizures. So how can you help? You can ask a question, and I'll answer it. Well, are you, or do you know, a puppeteer? We need some people to stand behind us <laughs> and make us tell our story. That's what we really need. So we want to have two troops. Ideally, we'd like to have about a dozen people. Yay! Barb is also looking for a volunteer coordinator. Click on the Links tab on our website if you can help. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.